I offer my patients a video of parts of their arthroscopic surgery that I narrate to them during surgery while they are asleep and provide to them on DVD. The example video you will see next is a shortened version of the actual surgery video I provided to this patient. The patient gave permission for online publication of this video. Okay, Roselle, this is Dr. Eisenberg and the team. We just got into your knee joint here. What you see in front of you is a blue cannula taking fluid outside the joint. Out of that blue cannula is a probe. That probe is one by three millimeters at the tip. That hole in the cannula is three millimeters in diameter, just to give you an idea of magnification. Um, we're going to take a tour around your knee. Okay, Roselle, so here we're in the lateral compartment of the knee, the outside. You have some arthritis here as well. Not awful. Um, here's your lateral meniscus. This is what a meniscus should look like. Your popliteus tendons behind there. You do have some fraying of the edges, so we're going to just trim that up with a little bit of a shaver just to make sure there's nothing that's going to rubber catch. Just trimming that little edge for you, nothing major. Just trimming this little frayed edge that the shaver didn't quite get all the way. Again, just a minimal meniscectomy here. Nothing significant. Okay, so there you have it. Nice and trimmed down outside meniscus here. We're going to take a look at, as I slowly extend your knee, your, tib uh, sorry, your femoral condyle, and that looks just fine. We'll take a picture of that. Okay, Rosal, we're in the posterior medial compartment of the knee. There's no uh, loose chips or anything floating around there. I'm taking a look at your meniscus right there. Um, and from this view, it looks reasonable, but this is where we expect it to start showing some signs of tearing. So I'll take a picture of that. That's your root. That looks fine. Your PCL is going to be right there. And your ACL is going to be right. You can see some of that tearing of that meniscus now as I'm coming back. And your ACL is going to be right in the front here. I'm going to just sneak out. And we'll get some flow going. And that's your ACL. And all that looks fine. Okay, Rosal. So I have good news here. I'm on your inside compartment of your knee where your meniscus tears. You do have some arthritis at this area right here. But your meniscus tear is pretty bad. So I do expect you to have pretty good relief from this. And you could see, so that's the good news. It's, it's good that it's bad because it means that most likely you should have pretty significant relief from the pain. You could see as I just put the probe there, I'll take a picture. Your meniscus is just completely torn. Uh, unfortunately, it means we'll have to take out a fair amount of it, but otherwise you should do pretty well with this. Okay, Roselle, so I'm just starting from the very back to get a little bit of that normal meniscus because you need to have a smooth transition from normal to where we take the tear off. So I'm just trimming down your posterior horn, you could see, so that I get to the apex of the tear, which is going to be more to the right of the screen here. And as we get some chips like that, we're going to pull this out. I'll give you that. And we're going to flush them out with this cannula. And I'll show you. Okay, Rosal, we got some of that bite, um, biting done in the posterior meniscus. I'm going to just use a shaver, take in whatever is loose, and then we'll continue with the biter. All right, Roselle, just going back right towards the apex. You can see it's split in the middle here. We're going to just trim out the bottom part here a little bit to g give us some room to access the top. So we go over the top here. We're going to connect to where we started. Just a different angle here I'm using. It lets me get on top of this a little bit better to make sure I get that meniscus fully resected for you. Okay, Roselle. I'm looking from the other cannula now sorry, from the other portal, and I'm connecting the dots. You could see from your anterior horn to the mid-zone where your meniscus tear goes all the way to your capsule. So I'm resecting this back all the way to the apex of the tear where you could see it's all the way to the capsule. And make a nice smooth transition which you see it starting to get to that point. Just cleaning up a little more here with the shaver. So this looks good here, uh, Roselle, from the one portal. We're going to switch portals one more time and take a look from the other side and make sure we're Okay, Roselle, Roselle, we're all done here. You can see we resected the meniscus, a nice smooth transition. I'm going to get some flow going so we get some of that ooze gone for you. There we go. So you can see a nice smooth transition in the back towards the front where we resected all the way to the anterior horn. That looks great. You have a little bit of arthritis here we just cleaned up. We're going to go to the upstairs of your knee. We're going to clean up that little flap right here on the side. We're going to just wash it out, and we'll be done. So you did great. Make sure you use lots of ice. Call me if you need me, and thank you for your trust.